Hey, what is up YouTube and welcome to episode number 10 of my 2022 bodybuilding prep and the episode that we're looking at today is the pro qualifier in Melbourne uh, on the 23rd of April 2022. So this is a basically a national level uh, show and for this show I just did the classic. So I was in class A uh, in the classic open. So uh, all the top guys in Australia trying to go uh, for this title. And the first photos that we're looking at here are just the compulsory poses of all the competitors um, that were in the lineup uh, before they did any call outs. So uh, I weighed in at 91.5 kilos at the weigh-in. So I was a little bit fuller for this show because I didn't have to make weight for the under 90s as I wasn't doing a bodybuilding class and my cutoff for classic physique is 93 kilos so I uh, had a little bit more room to play with didn't need to deplete so badly um, and, and drop the water so badly so I was a little bit fuller for this competition uh, as far as my own personal physique I think I, this is the best physique that I brought to the stage in terms of muscularity um, and condition and just overall quality uh, but there definitely is some more room to move uh, definitely some improvements that I want to make before my next show. So just looking at the poses here, so this is just the first sort of call out. And as you can see, um, the, the two guys next to me, so 92 and 89, uh, they placed higher than me. So I, I eventually uh, came sixth in this lineup. Um, so they got 89 was the winner. I think his name is Matt Orchard. Uh, and 92 placed fourth, so and, and I was sixth. So uh, that was the first bit. Then this was the uh, the first call out, and I was placed in the middle at the start. So I thought, wow, you know, here we go. Um, because I did finish second at this competition last year, I was pretty confident, and I was like, okay, here we go. The judges are going to make the right call today. But um, and and that's the and that's the top six guys. But uh, then I was. Uh, moved out to the side and that's when you know uh, things are not going great <laughs> uh, if you're on the side that's not where you want to be but uh, this is the top six just going through the poses and as you can see um, it's not much in this competition so it's a very close competition I was very happy with uh, the fullness and condition of my upper body for this competition my back was looking good uh, the only areas that I um, was a little bit disappointed in was my legs were not as crisp as they normally are and my glutes were all, uh, always a bit of a weak point I think what happened with the um, with the legs was I use we used the hot stuff I think it was the hot stuff uh, tan at the back I think it just made my legs look a little bit too shiny um, which kind of took away a little bit of the definition because they were looking um, very nice and hard uh, before the show and, and during all my um, uh, posing before the show at the gym. Um, the, the only thing is I need to bring out a little bit more detail in the, in the abductors and the cer serratus, I think it is, which is next to the quads. If I can, if you, yeah, you can see number 89 has got good detail right through his leg. And that's uh, that's what I'll be working on for next time. So obviously a little bit disappointed in the result. I didn't, uh, going by the photos, I didn't think there was too much in the competition. Um, I was going in this competition to win and I was pretty confident that I was going to do well. So I was disappointed, but uh, I will just have to work on my weak points for next time. And that's mostly the glutes. So in these side poses, I'm not getting enough detail through my quad um, and hamstring separation. Uh, as you can see, I've probably got the biggest legs on stage, but just need to get that little bit more detail. I still need more detail in the lower abs, even though they're looking a lot better than before. Uh, upper body, look, I was pretty good. Back can always improve. I can always, I need to still improve my lats. Um, and things like that just to give the overall balance of the physique uh, if I can bring the triceps up as well that would be good and just more control over the abdominals which is um, what I'm working on but uh, that is the competition wrapped up 
a little bit disappointed in the result, but uh, we'll just have to be better for next time. Um, and keep following along as I, the next episodes will be focused on uh, coming out of the competition and reverse dieting and going through the detox phase. So I'll catch you guys again soon.